Hi everyone, today we're going to be diving into a topic that's both delicious and nutritious. 11 superfoods to reverse insulin resistance and type 2 diabetes. My name is Diana Lacalzi and I'm a registered dietitian and certified diabetes care and education specialist. And I'm on a mission to help people reverse insulin resistance and place their type 2 diabetes into remission for good. So if that sounds good to you, give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to our channel. So let's dive into the 11 superfoods to eat if you have type 2 diabetes. So number one, let's kick things off with berries. These gems are packed with antioxidants and can significantly improve insulin sensitivity. Their vibrant colors aren't just visually appealing, they're actually indicative of the array of nutrients that can help improve blood sugar levels. There is tons of evidence to show that the more berries we eat, the less risk we have of developing type 2 diabetes. In one systematic review and meta-analysis, the researchers found that people who ate berries on a regular basis had an 18% reduction in developing type 2 diabetes. The paper also showed that for every 17 grams per day increase in berry consumption led to a 5% reduction in risk of type 2 diabetes. So not only are berries delicious, but they are fantastic at preventing type 2 diabetes. Number two, let's chat about chia seeds. These tiny seeds are a powerhouse for antioxidants, omega-3 fatty acids, magnesium, and fiber. Just one ounce of chia seeds contributes almost 10 grams of fiber. So beyond their impressive nutrition profile, they're also heart healthy and can improve insulin sensitivity. In one systematic review and meta-analysis, the researchers found that chia seeds were very heart healthy. They had a protective effect on our lipid profile, meaning they decreased total cholesterol, triglycerides, and LDL or bad cholesterol, and increased HDL or good cholesterol. And people with type 2 diabetes are twice as likely to suffer from heart complications than a person without type 2 diabetes. So including chia seeds in your diet can help reduce some of those diabetes complications and contribute to better heart health. Next on our list are avocados. Avocados are full of healthy fats and fiber. So when you add them to meals, they can help slow down the absorption of glucose into our bloodstream. In one particular study, people with type 2 diabetes who consumed on average about a third of an avocado a day had significantly lower A1C and fasting blood sugar levels. So number four is going to be squash, zucchini, and other non-starchy vegetables. These vegetables are going to be higher in fiber and low in calories. So you can add them to your meals to create more volume without necessarily adding a ton of calories. They're great to fill you up and keep you full for long. Longer, and they help aid in weight management and better blood sugar control. Number five is chili peppers. So not only do chili peppers add a nice crunch, color, and spice to your meals, but they could actually help improve your blood sugar levels too. In one study, the researchers found that eating chili peppers either before or during your meal led to reduced post-meal blood sugar and insulin levels. Okay, broccoli or broccoli sprouts are next on our list. Broccoli and broccoli sprouts aren't just high in fiber, but they're also very high in a specific compound called sulforaphane. Sulforaphane has been shown to reduce insulin resistance, improve blood sugar levels, and reduce inflammation. In one particular study, people with type 2 diabetes who consumed broccoli sprouts on a daily basis had significantly lower A1C levels and fasting blood sugar levels compared to those people who did not. Broccoli and broccoli sprouts can be easily added to stir fries, to soups, to your salads. On to number seven, garlic. Adding garlic to your meals can be a tasty way to benefit your health. So several studies show that eating moderate amount of garlic, so about one clove or more a day, if you have type 2 diabetes, can improve blood sugar regulation and improve insulin sensitivity. Results from nine different studies looking at garlic intake and type 2 diabetes found significant reductions in fasting blood sugar levels in just one to two weeks. And A1C levels were significantly reduced after 12 weeks. So definitely add some garlic to your meals if you do have type 2 diabetes. Number eight is olive oil. It's rich in monounsaturated fat, which is a healthy type of fat. And it's a key component of a heart healthy diet and improved insulin sensitivity. Results from many different studies show that olive oil consumption is associated with the reduced risk of type 2 diabetes, cardiovascular disease, and mortality. Remember though, a little bit goes a long way with olive oil. Just one tablespoon of olive oil has 120 calories, so it is very easy to get a lot of calories from a little olive oil. So use olive oil sparingly. A little bit of olive oil goes a long way. So number nine, let's shift our focus to beans. 
They're not only super versatile and delicious, but also very high in fiber. This high fiber content slows down glucose absorption, making them an excellent food for blood sugar management. Beans are also a great source of plant-based protein, making them a great swap for red and processed meats. There's tons of evidence to show that when we replace animal proteins with more plant-based proteins, we significantly reduce our risk of type 2 diabetes and type 2 diabetes complications. Number 10 is spinach and other dark leafy greens. Spinach and other dark leafy greens are packed with vitamins, nutrients, antioxidants, and phytochemicals, all really important components when reversing type 2 diabetes. You can easily add dark leafy greens to your salads, soups, smoothies, and other meals. They're a great way to get nutrients in and a great way to add volume to your meals, helping to fill you up and keep you full for longer. Last but not least, let's talk about flax seeds. These tiny seeds are a fantastic source of fiber and alpha linoleic acid, or ALA for short, which is a type of omega-3 fatty acid. They're very anti-inflammatory and can reduce some of the inflammation caused by type 2 diabetes. In one study, researchers found that men with type 2 diabetes who consumed 15 grams of flaxseed a day experience significantly lower blood sugar responses compared to those who did not consume flaxseed. Flax seeds are best consumed ground up or as flax meal and can be easily added to smoothies, cereals, and yogurt bowls. All right, those are some of the 11 superfoods to have if you have type 2 diabetes. You don't need to consume all 11 foods, but try and pick a few that you can start consuming on a weekly basis. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. See you next time.